Okay, hello everybody. This is uh, Bones. I know I said I was gonna do a board game for the next one, but we're doing uh, Yandre Simulator because this one was requested. And we basically stalk a bunch of other girls that are after your senpai guy, which I. I'm not great with anime or any of this stuff in this, so. I really don't know what the hell I'm doing, but we're gonna pretend I do. You basically just run around and kill people. This game is free to download, the link will be in the description thing. For the sake of YouTube, apparently they flip out if this game shows panties, so there is something that I have to do to block that, so we're gonna do that first. Which is really weird because uh, I've seen Let's Plays of another game uh, called Haiti, and she has quite a large backside, and they just they show that. <coughs> <coughs> and uh, YouTube seems to allow it just fine, but hey, I'm not judging. Um, and because this is a work in progress, the guy has a Whatchamacallit, a uh, debug menu, you can talk to people, we're in a Japanese school, there's one dude, when you hear that little heartbeat thing that is your senpai guy who apparently, rather than do the normal human being thing and talk to him, you, you just slaughter the hell out of any girl that is not you, and this is your rival. Uh, my daughter has taught me all of this stuff. She, she knows all about this game. She's like, she is the pro at this. So she gave me a crash course in the history of it, how to play it roughly. Uh, although I'm still going in very much blind because I suck at it. So don't expect amazing things here, people. I'm just going to play this and... Uh, We'll see how I do. Basically, we're going to see uh, how many rivals. Look at, how, look, how smug, look at how smug this lady is. She looks so happy I took her picture. I feel like that could be my own sister. She looks like this. That's how my sister is. If she don't like the picture, she just gives me that mean ass look. But she's like, take it. Not, look, that lady is way too happy. I don't trust her at all, that's suspicious. And you take these, and I learned that these, uh, they help you find out information about your rivals. So all of these chicks are up for my man, so I gotta, they gotta die. We're going hood. We're killing off our competition, and this lady, uh, my daughter pointed out, is based off of a famous Vocaloid, and I know this lady uses a fashion, I knew this one, this is, it's a style called Ganguro, where they try to emulate California American girls, so they will do like fake tans and dye their hair blonde, and they eat, why did I take her picture twice, she looks, this is pissy the second time. I'm actually going to take all the guys' pictures, too, because I want all the information I can get. If I'm going to be killing people randomly, then I feel like I can't be too careful here. Um, and also, there's, a, I guess the person you're sending this to is, like, this creepy chick called Infochan who is probably a stalker. Um, I mean, who the hell else knows this much about people just based on one picture? So I get the feeling she's... <laughs> there's, a, there's a guy version of that chick, and he is still just... He needs a slap in the face. He is so pissy looking. Grumpy ass son of a bitch. Stare at me like that, sir. Punchy one. Um... Yeah, looks like he's freaking like nine, right? 
I think that's all of them. I've probably even like done one or two of these twice. I, I don't really care. Did I get this guy? I think I got that guy. We're gonna <laughs> have my. This has been like the phone simulator so far. This hasn't even been murder simulator. So we're gonna go ahead now. I have done my duty for cleaning country. Classrooms. Classrooms, I can get some weapons in there. Uh, we were goofing around a bit with this. So, obviously, um, there are different clubs. There's drama, cooking, um, and different clubs have different benefits. Oh, see, this one's got little masks and stuff, so for disguises, that would be good. But I am going to go with one that my daughter showed me that allows me to... I want that knife. Thank you. Give me this. I need this. They don't care. Um, and then you have to hide your weapons. Because you don't want to be walking around the school with just weapons. This is not the 70s. So. It's a sewing room. There's a home ec room. The art room, though, my daughter pointed out, uh, people will not flip out if you have blood on your smack because they just think it's, you know, like, paint. So that is going to be a big use to us. So we're going to join that, the art club. So we are on our way to join that. I think she said that's on the second floor. So... Big shout out to my fiance and my daughter, who I love. This is the first time you guys have learned anything about phones, so don't be creepy with this shit. It's gonna be all stock rush, alright? Be nice. Seriously, guys, be nice. Um, also, you can compliment people in this game, and it helps your reputation. And since I'm gonna be a serial killer, I kind of feel like I, that might come in handy. Art club, there we go. There we go. That's what I want. This lady's creepy though. Join club. See, it's like faceless. You have joined the club. I have joined the club. But she has this weird monotone. We're talking. Ta-da! I like that she has on a little French parade too. Just... So now we got two weapons. We got a box cutter and a Knife, and that knife is called a Chris knife. That is the actually the cut of the blade. There is a llama that's a female victim or a male victim, and I don't know why, but I hit ye, and that changes. So that's interesting. Um, anyways, I know there are people up on the roof I can kill because we've goofed around a bit, so we're gonna start whittling down a few people there. Um, you gotta be careful though because the witnesses, there's stuff like blood, there's stuff like... Um, I mean there are things you have to consider in this. Again, there's a dude who developed this for free. I have to give him some credit. This is a lot of work to put into something. If the developer sees us, uh, did some good job on the 3D modeling, definitely. And just the variety and creativity that you put into this is kind of staggering for something you have released to the public to play for free is uh, pretty admirable of you. That you haven't just ran and made people outright, you know, buy it. That you have given people the choice that they can I just shank this chick. Shank her. It says near body. Well, yeah, kinda. So we're gonna drag her <laughs> away from the. I like that. Now look, guys. You can see over here. I like that I'm the creepy one, but that chick is clearly over there peeking on those two. My lady's a serial killer, and that's still less creepy somehow to me. No, 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 maybe that's just me, but that just, yeah, that's creepy. There's a giant blood trail there. 
Um, but there's a map and bucket up there, so I'm gonna actually try to clean that. And also, there were bathrooms somewhere around here. Yes, there are. There. So we're gonna go ahead and pull her into a bathroom and get rid of the body there. Um, even though I was visibly armed, nobody saw. Anyways, you can see where this is going in this game. Uh, and you play more than one day, by the way. I have to say that. I have seen... I wish you could, like, push the people in here. I don't... But at least the body is kind of in here. So we're gonna close the <laughs> That didn't... I did nothing! What is this? Near body. Yes, I am near the body, because I'm not done. Drop it. I don't want to drop the body yet. I want to... I've clearly broken this lady's legs in all sorts of horrible ways. Good enough. I'm a master of disguise. No one will ever notice what I have done there. That was flawless in every way. That was, uh... I'm clearly... Look at... I love how there is clearly a blood trail there. Uh, let's carry this map. I'm gonna dip it in the bucket first. No, fill bucket first. Okay, so dip in bucket first. Fill bucket first. Well, let's fill the friggin' bucket. No bucket. No, fill the bucket. Okay. Uh, bleach. For bleach. I missed a bucket. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, I dip. The water sparkles and sparkles. Alright, sweep. Sweep, sweep all this. No blood trail for me. I have an audience today over there on the couch, but they're probably bored out of their mind. What is going on? Are they just... I need to dip this in the bucket. Dip. Oh god, no. No, I got bloody footprints. This is not good. Let's clean that shit up. I don't want that leading toward me. I was doing so good. So if I literally, like, killed one lady, I'm not doing great here. Sentences you never think you hear yourself say. Alright, we're just totally MacGyver the actor. No, I don't have okay. I just want to drop this now. Okay. okay, so straight up murder to check. No worries, no problem there. Um Another, oh, see, there are too many people now, I don't, I am not about to try and be seen doing that. Now, I have classes, I think, that I'm supposed to attend that are probably going to be good for my alibi. I don't know if this is my class, but we're going to go in here anyway. Because, uh, why wouldn't I? Now, I do notice there's no teacher in here, and I don't know if that's something the guy's working on or not. Eventually, I suspect he will. Um, I've heard that they're doing, like, he's going to do a full release of this game, probably put it up on Steam. I could see people buying this. Um, you know, as long as the price isn't huge, I could see people picking this up. I mean, and for people who say this is shocking, let's be honest, Postal 1 and 2 were no different, you know, and they, they spawned an entire realm of controversy. Grand Theft Auto 1, they got that jackass Jack Thompson to outlaw and ban them and act like an idiot and, um, I mean, games are controversial 
by nature. You're always gonna, even the most innocent game, you're gonna have somebody who's gonna find something about it they do not like. That they're just gonna think is like, you know, you'd have a kid's game and there's still gonna be people that flip out about something. Do you not remember Teletubbies, right? Think of that. Oh, okay. So study points and then I get to go up in skill. Physical education. I feel like I want this lady to be strong. Boost my reputation game. What's my reputation? Uh, big love letters. That is good. Construct <laughs> chemical weapons. That's. Oh, I'm a serial killer. If I learned anything from Dexter, biology has to be the first thing that we focus on. Um, I do like that there, see, you'll, you'll notice there's a little outline for class on the desk, so that is also cool. Now, can I exploit this? I can. Alright, so if you're watching this, Deb, this is a bug you're definitely going to want to, you're going to want to fix. Um, he's probably like, well, don't show people. Sorry. To me, if, I, if I'm helping you out here, Dev, then, you know, all the better. Or maybe it's not. Maybe I had two sessions for this. Look at how good this kid is. He's cleaning the desk. And this lady here is cleaning something. Go, go. Let's talk to you, lady. Come here. Uh, compliment. I feel like complimenting everybody is good because it keeps them from suspecting us of any wrongdoings, which is great. I also feel like if I can pick off people in the bathrooms and roots, that's going to help our murder numbers. Hold on. Oh, there's a girl in the bathroom, and that's creepier sounding than I meant it to. Sounded like I was one of the Weinstein brothers for a minute. Alright. Yeah, I went there. Whatever. Well, I killed her. And we're getting the hell out of here. Because that, uh... That was pretty smooth. So that's two of Senpai's... Intruding? What am I intruding on? Oh, God. I don't know. I think if I go to the wrong class, that's intriguing, so let's, let's not do that. I'm trying to not do obvious things, like, I obviously don't want to kill people out in the open, because I just don't think that's... Not on my first day, at least, you know? We'll save that. Um, this is a debug build for testing, this game says, and... Again, this guy is pretty frequent. He's a very active developer. Guy. Um, also, when you guys download this, you'll see this is a massively well-funded game. I was actually really surprised by how many companies were behind this, but there are a bunch. So, this is one of those projects that, uh, unlike some, and again, I'm not trying to point fingers at other developers who, who put out a lot of words and say they're going to finish something and don't, but there are a few who have, uh, in the past, started a game and just never finished. You're going to see, I think, this one completed. Um, this guy's got all the means to actually fully finish this one, and I think they're going to see that. And I just also killed one of the other guys, because he was in the bathroom and why not? And plus, right now, I am just going flat out crazy on people, and if I can see, visibly insane, <laughs> visibly insane. Um, now, 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 I know that I can keep <laughs> making her laugh, and if you look down in the lower right corner, you'll see that thing there. But I discovered by accident, if you hold, I think it's if you hold down control here, you can see different things, like you'll see the bodies, you'll see interactive objects, so that's kind of neat too, I did that. 
I feel like I could probably get away with, you know, we're gonna turn this light off. Maybe that'll help people from seeing blood on the floor. Let me, uh... Also, I'm not getting any comments here, uh, guys. Do you guys like this mask or the old mask better? Um, all you subscribers out there, can you leave me comments which mask you like better? This one says I'm intruding, so we're gonna close. Kind of ironic that I got Emma from Drama Club, eh? I also like a cult club, because we certainly did not have that club at school. Very liberal school. I feel like this school would take place in California. If this were in the, <laughs> in the States. This would be like the liberal arts school. Oh my god. I can solid snake shit. No one can notice me. <laughs> I'm uh, sneaky beaky now. Look at this. Dun dun. Now I wonder if that's a real company because I am not Japanese, I do not know. Or Korean or Asian. Not necessarily trying to make fun of any Asian or Asianic person of any culture at all. But I'm just saying I I don't know. Uh I don't, I don't think I can. I don't think I can actually kill them. I think that's a teacher. So. I love that I'm a box running all the way down the hallway. This is funny. Uh, but I mean, again, guys, for a free game, you have to admit this is a pretty well done game. Uh, again, pretty amazing. I'm not near the body now. I'm nowhere near the body. I am a box. Now, I don't know how the hell to get the box out. <laughs> I use the camera. I can only take a picture in the box. I love it. We're gonna say that. How do I get this out? Okay, I, I hit the... So they're definitely gonna find the dead body. Yeah, see, somebody said, oh my god, it's at a dead body. I'm getting out of here, but that's alright, because I'm nowhere near the dead body, so. I'm in the clear. So I've killed like five people today, I think. Um, so, you know, productive day. I'm sorry, I can't talk right now. Okay, so apparently, as soon as school's over, they. They're, they just bounce, they're done with you. Look at that lady's hair. Go get over here. That's some huge hair. I don't know what I'm trying to show you, Implecan. I did not map up blood. I did not dispose of a corpse. Oh. And at the end of the day, um, there's like a little thing where cats come and Oh, shit. Somebody saw me acting crazy. They're like, why are you acting so weird? Yeah, I don't know, because I've killed a bunch of people. So, uh, I don't know what to do now. I think I just wait. And then after time, it goes in the next day. Let me look over here. Is that, is that correct? You wait, it goes in the next day. Thumbs up, thumbs down, over there. I wait, it goes in the next day. I'm in a hedge maze of some sort, I don't know what I'm doing. Um, again, free game, uh, the link to the download site. Uh, the guy updates us a lot. By the time you watch this, I don't know when you watch this. But who knows, it could be a totally different build with a bunch of different things. And if I feel like this is a teacher right here. She seems nice. Friendly but strict. Uh, gym teacher. 
self-defense, extensive training, well, we do not want to piss her off then, because I don't feel like getting body checked by the gym teacher. That's... In other words, we don't want the gym teacher to see us kill people. It's what that amounts to. It. I'm basically trying to see, no, I must not. What is that? Okay. Okay, here is where I need to go. Go home. This whole time I've been running around like an idiot, and all I needed to do was go there. The police arrive at the school, and now we got like investigative music. Do, 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 do. do I hit a button, or is this just. Okay. Please discover the corpses. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's count that again. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, okay, five. Five on my first day. That's not great, but that's not too bad. They're unable to locate any murder weapons. It's because I'm carrying them. Um, they're unable to link me to any crimes. They don't have enough evidence to perform an arrest. Now they can't stop. Some pie until he has returned home safely, then returns to her own home. The account club no longer has enough members to remain operational. Huh. Well, that's pretty interesting. So if you kill members from a club, then they uh, will actually go... And that's kind of neat. That's like a little fake face, uh, Facebook page there. I think that's pretty cool how they, how they do that. Um, and I, I'm pretty sure my options are just... I can read a manga. I have a shrine to the dude I'm stalking. Holy shit, I have his toothbrush. I have his toothbrush. Holy cow. This is an apple that Senpai was eating. Licking the teeth marks is so much fun. Ah, oh, sweet Jesus. downright horrifyingly creepy. Go to sleep, yes. That's uh, okay guys, now this is my last day here and then after this we're gonna call it an end to this let's play, but I hope you guys are enjoying this so far. Um, I don't know... keep my weapons or not, I guess I'll see. It'd be handy if I did, though. that save me some leg work. So the bathroom has been, my, so far, my, like, my base of operations. It's been my best, my best one. Now, um, I don't know where you guys are from, but I went to an American school, and in my American school, nope, no murder weapons. Well, that is some BS. Uh, so I gotta go. I already got all the information on these kids I need right now. That sounds creepy. Let's not say that twice in a sentence. Um, so we are going to immediately... I don't want to mess with this, the faculty because... I'm afraid they're going to start, you know, putting two and two together, getting suspicious. So instead, let's look for classrooms that I can just quote-unquote barrel things from. Uh, the sewing club has this pair of scissors that may not be great, but scissors are small, they're easily hideable. They'd be good for shanking people. How is Homek? Homek is blank today. Um, and again, I think some of these things are what they call placeholders. A lot of video games have these. Um, and I want to say to you, for anybody who might be dogging this game a little, or, you know, oh, well, he doesn't have this done or that done, da da da. Remember, this is one guy doing all of this, so. To me, anyway, I gotta say, I think it's pretty impressive what he's already accomplished. 
uh, in terms of modeling everything, 3D modeling, in terms of the music, in terms of programming. Um, this stuff is not easy. Um, I tried my hand at programming years ago. Um, I programmed back when BASIC was the thing in Commodore 64. And that is true. That is very true. Um, and our job was to make a turtle, which was basically just like a stupid asterisk, go across the screen. So, uh oh. There's some shit popping off there between these two guys there. There's some arguing. What's what's the deal? Look at see how guilty he looks? That is What did I catch you doing? Huh? Personality coward, it says. Self-defense incapable. No student has ever seen the right side of his face. Very interesting facts about some of these guys here, right? Look at both of them look like they're about to freak out on me. Self-defense incapable. So these are account club members, and apparently they like freak out when you look directly at them. Uh, so kind of like the Gap people that I used to know. Uh, I actually used to know a Gap guy that used to call himself Lord Darkness. And, uh, I'm not kidding you, he insisted everybody call him Lord Darkness. What in the hell did I do there? I have turned into some crazy... I think I just found like a hidden outfit. Now I'm... What is this? What have I done? Uh, who cares? I work with it. Do I still have my weapon at least? I do. I'm asking the important questions here, guys. Do I have my weapons? Well, screw it. Let's see if we can find some people. So basically, by the end of the week, from what it looks like, I'm trying to whittle this down to just me and somebody. Because this lady is crazy, and in her world, I'm guessing it's all about her and senpai, and everybody else can bite it. So, you know, so we are trying to make her fight for her love. Literally. Okay, like, she's going to kill people. So, physical education, we're going to put all of her points in this time. I want her to be able to just crush people with her sheer raw uh, strength and prowess like a puma. Alright. Alright, so Dev, I don't know if that's a bug that I found for you where I can just go to class twice in the same sitting or if that's meant to happen, but if it's a bug I found for you, you're welcome. And if not, then uh, and it's meant to happen, then uh, that's convenient. So thank you. Saves me a lot of legwork. I love that this guy is not at all weirded out that there's a chick in his bathroom following him into a cell. No! Oh, Jesus. Well, one problem with the scissors is certainly not as uh, tidy. I have blood all over me now. That is not good. And people are going to freak the hell out. So I need to get... Nope, don't worry about it. Teachers, don't, uh, you don't see me with blood on me, right? Shit. I don't like this part to die. Can I, can I wash? I can't wash up. What does this do? Oh, you can hide me. That's, that's good. I'm not so much worried about hiding. I'm worried about hauling ass to get to, like... Uh, the shower area, something like that. I know there's like a shower area in here where you can go and like, get blood off you. I didn't think I would need it, quite honestly, yet. But, uh, yeah, we're not going to use that weapon again, I don't think. That is just too... Too risky. I don't like that. Um, and this area is interesting because the dude has been very careful since the chip lies here with making sure that 
the bits that should be covered are very carefully covered, so you do please the guy, don't cry and censor this one, it's, it's all good. See, there's like fog and bubbles and all that crap, so. It's right, and her arms are black and all wonky, and so. Even better. Now we're gonna put on her uh, gym uniform, and that is clean. And then no more blood. Also, there is a uh, choice wrong. I have glitched out. I have glitched out completely. I look like some weird transformer from hell. So, I don't know what I've done. Part of her arms are like black and robotic now. Smashing. This is great. No one will suspect a thing, clearly. Uh, let's let's go back over here now. There, even better. That fix that. So then, uh, I can I go back to Gamacon? Is there a better like weapon I can use? There is this thing here, the magical girl wand. But this one, I do not think I can hide. It's just it is there. And obviously we have reach with that one, but I don't want to get my ass tackled. Uh, knife! Yes, the knife is good. So let's worry about the butcher knife. I think that's going to be a modus operandi for... Look at me using big words today. I can do it! Alright, my smack! Can I put the smack back on? Right. Christ! And yes, we are totally swapping the scissors for the box cutter because the scissors suck. Ah. Greetings. Greetings. Too early. Don't too early, me lady. I need to kill. Mama son's got an itch. I need scratching. And the only cure. There's more cowbell and murder. In that order. The cow murder. Cowbell murder. Not, not cow murder. Cowbell murder. I don't want Peter freaking out of me. That's all I need. God, I actually forgot that this game had a proper uh, thing there, too. But if you look up there. There is a class, like a school, yeah, school class. I forgot about that. Um, so this lady here, we are going to try to sneak up on. And yoink! We got her. And the famous words of Dave Chappelle, gotcha, bitch! Huh? Hey right, guys, see what I did? We want to hide her. Now there is an incinerator. There are other means of disposing of people. Um, now obviously, in Western culture, this game is going to come across as being horribly taboo and um, <laughs> not as humorous or lighthearted, which I, I do get. And it's not that it is lighthearted by any means, you know, we're still talking about a semi-serious subject of murder, but uh, let's at least give credit to the fact that the guy put his heart and soul into a project, did a game where there are consequences for this stuff, Instead of just making it, oh, you know, you get to do this, and I'm edgy, and this is funny because I'm edgy. Um, I would rather that it's not one of those, and it is not. As far as I have ever seen this, there are... Um, every single day, the cops investigate this. There's always, like, crazy stuff that can happen, and so it's, uh... It's, it's serious. So... I mean, obviously not entirely, there's humor, but... I mean, my, my lady's running around wearing a fox tail after shanking a lady on 
top of a school. I'm not saying it was a Citizen Kane. I'm just saying, you know, it's not like this guy's doing this just to be edgy. Uh, but no, so far this is quite an interesting little game. Um, I own Postal 2, and back in the day I've had the, the pleasure of talking quite a bit with the creator of Postal 2, uh, Vince Desi, and even some of the other people on that team, and they're great people, very friendly, very nice people. They're not psychopaths or, you know, socially bereft people, or there's nothing wrong with them. Um, they just wanted to make a very interesting, unique game, and they, they made it with Postal, and it was this kind of social commentary on violence in America, and then they made Part 2, and added a little humor in it, and... Oh, let's see... Faculty do not allow any students uh, to uh, please arrive at the school. Only two today. Discover scissors that assume it's a flood. Ah, uh, shit. So I got busted. She will, she will never have some pie. I like that that is the ending right there. She will never have some pie. Arrested. Big red letters. Seriousness, guys. Alright, well, thank you guys very much for watching my stalker voyage here as a member of the Weinstein family, apparently. Um, again, the link for this is going to be below. This is a free one, so if this seemed interesting to you, uh, go download it. Um, at the very least, if one of your friends likes anime and might like it, even if you don't like anime and you like games like Postal 1 or 2, or you just want to play something different, then it's free. And honestly, it's like a, a three minute download, so why the hell not? Uh, give it a try, see what you think. Subscribe, like, and tell your friends about us, and pass our Let's Plays along, please, it helps us. Um, post in the comments. Uh, on which games we should do, and which look you like better, the old look for Bones or the new look. And like I said, coming up will be our Let's Play a Board Game channel, um, which is going to be this channel, but just a different playlist. And then a story time for grown-ups, which is Muppets only, or uh, Puppets only, ooh, Puppets only. No Muppets, Puppets. Don't see Wes Disney. Okay. Uh, you guys have fun, and thanks for watching.